more lunch break. Welcome to another episode of Lunch Break. We have some guests in the house. First of all, we have Mike. You've seen him a lot on a Lunch Break a lot. And then we have some first timers at Lunch Break, the j twins, Jason and Justin. Hello, What's up? So great to be here. I've always wanted to be a part of Lunch Break. We wanted you guys on here for a very long time. I'll have Absolutely. you. Yeah. What took you guys so long? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> it's just so hard to fill two seats, you know, and like take two people out. It's hard. You might have recognized them from uh, Asian Bachelorette. Just Thai food is not from Taiwan. <laughs> <laughs> we should have had Thai food. That would have been great. But um, if you guys don't know, these guys are brothers, but also twins. If you can't tell, I mean, he's, he's rocking the glasses today, though, so it's definitely. <gasps> oh, I see it now. Oh, see it now? Yeah. Uh, we thought since we're having some brothers on and we're really close because we're like best buds. Long lost. We used to be identical, but then, you know, I just... Wait, well, are you guys actually best friends in real life or just that skit? I call you my best friend. Are you, are you my... Are you one of them? Wait, this is the first time I've ever heard this, actually. <laughs> the, has, we haven't DTR'd this. I have a lot of best friends, but you're one of my best friends. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, I thought it'd be fun if we played a little game together today. We're gonna play the best friend challenge. We've played it a few times on this channel already, but today we'll do a little variation of it since uh, we'll go head to head. But like, okay, honestly, like, they they probably do know each other better because they're, they're like brothers. Yeah. And they lived, they like grew up together. Oh, what's that pun? We were woo mates. Oh. Oh. We were mates. So, and we're still roommates. Oh, this is a challenge. If we beat you, that's like really sad. I mean, I don't see how it's possible for us to lose because we basically have all the same interests, the same friends, same morning routines, same DNA. sleeping habits, same everything. DNA, DNA yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, I think it's gonna be a little tough for you guys. We'll see. Good luck. We're gonna ask them a question, see if their answers match. They're gonna ask us a question, see if our answers match. Mm -hmm. We'll go back and forth and see who comes out on top. We'll go first. You know, let's start out a little easy. I'm sure you guys already know this. What would you say is Jason's greatest fear? Oh man, I think Justin might know my greatest fear more I, than I do. How would I know what your fear is if? I just, I'm gonna win, like, dude. I just feel like you know me better. They know each other too well. No, that's true. That's yeah. true. That's sometimes. Okay. We got this. I already know they have a secret language. Yes, we do. Do they? One, two, three. Ooh! Free falling skydiving. Amusement, amusement park, park rides. Ooh! <laughs> They're very Pretty similar. Yes. It's very similar. Same, same, same feeling. Like uh, I'm afraid of those like butterfly feel feelings from free falling, I guess. And that's you know same, same thing. It's very close. I'm it's not gonna so give that to you. <laughs> <laughs> what? Are you the judge? It's because it's because my sister forced us on like a bunch of roller coasters when we were younger. And so now I'm traumatized. Oh. Should we start with a banger? <laughs> what is one thing that would instantly make Mike happy? <laughs> if he saw it. I'm gonna write something. Yeah. If you don't write if you don't write it. Wow, that's, he, he knew I'm the gonna, I'm gonna look really dumb. Um, <laughs> I'm curious now. Oh shoot. But Mike's Mike, such a happy person. When Mike like, it's instantly happy. happy. Oh. <laughs> He's already here. He's already sorry. Three, Three, two, two one. one. Oh! oh! Ah, you know what? That's what I meant. You left. You left man out. Yeah, my man crush. <laughs> it's really close because I would tell Taylor about this immediately. Yeah. Okay. I've definitely. Seen him react to those things. So that makes sense. He does get really giddy. Okay. This is true too though. This yeah. is very true. What is Justin's favorite Wong Fu short? <laughs> Justin, do you even know what your favorite <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna put I know what I'm putting. Um, the fact that you're writing something oh. is great. Duh. Wait, can it just be um, Duh. short or simple? Yeah. Okay. Duh! I got it. <laughs> hey, no hands. No hands. This is easy. <laughs> Show. All right, one, one two, two, three. Boom. Oh. 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 Wait. Oh, Wait, really? That's, that's so nice. Yeah. Easy. Well, I think. Oh, dang. That's so nice. I mean, you guys have done a lot of really great things, but I think this one really like hit the spot for me because I think it, you guys talked about so many sensitive things and it was really relatable. And Phil's acting, holy crap. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Next level. So bad. Good job. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, next level. <laughs> All right, this one's for Taylor. So Taylor's on a date with a girl. Yes. And they're talking about cats. Uh-huh. 
What's the first pun pickup line he would use? Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh, here we go. First thing that comes to mind. First of all, I don't know if I would say a pun on a first date. <laughs> okay? It's too soon for puns. In a world where you're In a saying. world. <laughs> I think girls tend to like the basic ones. So do I. Hey, <laughs> what? Should we do one present them? Because it's like a joke. Okay, okay. You you present yours. <laughs> right. And then I'll reveal if it matches. Right, I'll be Taylor mm -hmm. for a second. All right. I don't do that on dates. Shall we get dessert? Um. Shall we go right meow? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh damn it. I went even more basic. More basic than that? And it said, "You're perfect. Yeah. Oh. It's the perfect one." Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's the one we were expecting. Yeah. Justin. What did Jason get you for your birthday three years ago? <laughs> First of all, we don't really get each other gifts on our birthdays. <laughs> you don't, to be honest. Yeah. You know what it is? Because I think we're always so focused on giving gifts to other people. And so we're like, we share money, you know? So we're like always constantly giving gifts to other people. Trying to so get out of this question, We view our you? money as like each other's money. All right, so how about this? The last gift you guys gave each other. The last, last gift. gift. No talking, write it down. <laughs> I don't want any of this cheating going on here. Right. J J that Jason gave you. And then draw it. Okay, this is the worst drawing ever, but. <laughs> One, two, three. An oh. FM transmitter for hey. the radio. Oh my god! <laughs> you did too? Yeah. Nice. Just, yeah, because that year I got you like three different gifts and we guessed the same thing. <laughs> what a terrible gift. Oh. It was a, a Bluetooth connector so you can you know, plug your music to your car if My there's, car's no, oh. there's no Bluetooth, so. We're gonna get kind of personal here, guys. Ooh, okay, okay. A little personal. Okay. <laughs> Taylor, is Mike's belly button an Innie or an Audi? We know this about each other, so we expect you guys to know this about each other. You guys are true best friends. I think all of his followers know if he's an Innie or an Audi. <laughs> oh, oh, no, even I know if you're an Innie or an Audi, too. <laughs> Mike has quite a few shirtless pictures. Or do you? Yeah. Shirtless photos, right? I think I know, but like, so I, I don't know if I, I haven't like, I didn't like Zoom or anything, you know what I mean? <laughs> I was like, three, two, one. Any yes. <laughs> You did that little calligraphy, was like. That, I guess? No, I mean like, I feel like if it's an Audi, you would know. This is a question for both y'all. What is the one song that you think defines you both? Oh, damn. That is a hard one. That is a really hard one. Right. Wait, did you you already know? I have a feeling you're not gonna say what I'm gonna say, but Yes. Yes! <laughs> I'm gonna be disappointed if you don't get this. <laughs> One, two, three. I just said you'll be in oh. my heart. Oh. <laughs> okay, you know, so I said oh. none, too many to choose from. So that could have been an answer too. Okay, well the reason why I chose well, this one. Um, yeah, Tarzan, right? This, Tarzan, mm -hmm. and it, it, this is like one of our favorite Disney movies growing up. Oh. We used to like jam out to this song all the time. Cause I mean, one, it has a really good meaning. Mm -hmm. And yeah, the lyrics are amazing. And then also it's just a fun jam. Mm -hmm. Usher, Usher version. Usher oh. version, yes. Oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I thought you were get, totally gonna write it. Honestly, I'm kind of sad I didn't write that. Can you give us <laughs> a, <laughs> easier. a little <clears throat> Usher, You'll Be In My Heart? <clears throat> you'll be in my heart. Know you be in my heart. Surfing on the trees. From this day on, now and forevermore. Hey! hey. 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 Yosha version sounds weird without the music. Yeah. No, that's not great. It's, would your best friend rather eat poop that tastes like chocolate? <laughs> eat chocolate that tastes like poop. There's only one right answer. <laughs> Right? Okay. Three, Three two, two, one. Chocolate yeah. tastes like poop. Okay. Poop. I'm glad that they chose that. All right. <laughs> that was more of a test. That was. <laughs> Jason, write down Justin's step-by-step -step pho routine. Oh! These guys eat a lot of pho, and they're very particular about their pho, so. Damn, are we best friends? How'd you know that? <laughs> I might have gotten that from another source. <laughs> It's gonna be called the the best pho wrens challenge. Ah! This time, you'll go first, read it, and then you'll reveal after he finishes. Okay, so for, for, for mine, it says, number one, taste the broth. Mm. Ooh. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> Bro, you don't even know your own steps. <laughs> Come on. All right, taste some broth. See if it's actually good broth or if it's made out of MSG. Mm. <laughs> and if it's made out of MSG and it tastes like crap, then you might as well make it taste better. So he just, and then he adds sauce accordingly. Okay, then after that, tries it again. He's like, okay, this one needs a little black pepper. So he just puts a little black pepper, but he takes off the cap and puts the black pepper. He doesn't he leave the cap on. Mm -hmm. oh. <laughs> and after that, he adds the basil. This is so thorough. I didn't know we were gonna oh, be this crap. specific. Basil and bean sprouts, okay? Basil, <laughs> bean sprouts. And then he sauces up his side of onions. If you guys are trufa lovers, you guys always have the side of onions. And then feast. So that's that's mine. That's that's pretty dang plus. But what? yeah, I, I mean, I didn't leave. I mean, I spot on. Yeah, no, I left out the. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> he knows more about my pho um, eating routine than I do. <laughs> okay, so all right, let's see what this One, order a combo pho. We always order pho dakbik, which is combo, yes. and then two is. Bean sprouts. And sometimes I order them steamed if the broth isn't hot enough because the bean sprouts cool down the broth. And then I order basil and lime that comes with it. And then onions with vinegar, that's, just, uh, that's also called hanyam, uh -huh. right? And then hoisin and sriracha as a dipping sauce for the meat and then black pepper, mix and enjoy. Uh -huh. yeah. So that's pretty, pretty similar. Like 70, really 75 yeah. out of 100. Yeah. You're just more, you were just more thorough than I was. Yes. I need you to make a video about this right now. We should, we should. Like <laughs> a how-to. Yeah, that would be kind of cool. The fact that you were describing it so in detail, and you was like, um. Mm. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's like, they, they, they know each other. We'll, we'll end there. I think it's very clear that these guys know each other better than Mike and I know each other. I just think we got unfavorable questions. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just want to say thanks again for coming on lunch break. Hope it was a fun time for your first lunch break. Thank you for having Oh, friends. Okay. Yay! And you'll be in my heart. Let us know if you guys like this episode. Definitely enjoy these little challenges we do and uh, we can do more if you guys like it. Don't forget to follow these guys on all their social media and everything they're doing. Everyone's doing big things. At j Twins. <laughs> <laughs> check out uh, Wong Fu and check out the series Yappy on the main channel. Their favorite show. Their favorite <laughs> check out our Patreon. Check out our store for new merch. And we'll see you guys next week for another lunch break. Bye. Bye, guys. <laughs> Bye, guys.